Welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to install memory into your PC. So if you're new to the channel, my name's Travis and I love to film unboxing videos of cool new gear that I get for filmmaking and photography. If I ever go someplace cool, I'm definitely going to vlog about it. When I'm using Adobe Premiere Elements and I learn something new, I usually film a tutorial and put that on the channel too. And if I'm doing any DIY projects around the house, usually assembling IKEA furniture or something smart home related, I'm definitely going to film those too. So if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you take some time, head down below, hit that subscribe button. So if you're a long time subscriber to the channel, you might remember the video on when I built this PC. If you don't and you wanna see it, I'll put a link up here for that. This guy has done me well for a long time. I have a lot of footage now that's kind of 4K. I've been using my camera a lot more. And when I'm filming those Adobe Premiere Elements tutorials, I'm screen capturing at the same time that I have Adobe open. And this PC is starting to get a little bit sluggish with all of that going on. And I definitely can't afford a new graphics card right now, but memory is dirt cheap. So if you go on Amazon, I'll put a link in the description below. So just head down here and I'll have a link for it but you can grab memory cheap. So when I built this PC a year and a half, two years ago, I paid the exact same price that I paid for double the memory today. So in other words, it's half price within two years for double the memory. So I have a 16 gigabytes in there now. I'm upgrading to 32 gigabytes and I paid the same price for the 32 gigabyte DIMMs that I paid for the 16 gigabyte DIMMs. Uh, when I take these out, I'm actually going to relist them on Amazon because they work fine. Uh, so hopefully I will get some of the money back for the memory that's in there to go towards this new memory here, which is cheap link in the description below if you want to grab some of the stuff so let's get into the video i'm going to take the cover off the side pop out the old dims pop in the new dims okay so the first step is uh open your new memory well that was easy second step is to open up your pc case so we have our screws on the side, we've got those undone. Slide this over and pop the cover off. Your PC case might be a little bit differently, but all you gotta do is get inside to the motherboard. So the next step is to locate where your RAM is. And in our case, it's right here. So these are the other two DIMMs that we had. So we're just gonna take our new RAM, put it inside here, get it ready. And to pop these out, it's really easy. On each side, there is a clip. So we're just gonna push down on the clip on one side, push down on the clip on the other side, and that memory is released. So we're gonna take this dim here and pop out this guy here. And put this in. Like so, and place this one back inside. Okay, and once you're sure that it's completely lined up, you're just gonna slowly press down and you'll hear a click. Click on one side and clicked on the other side. So there we have it. That's one replaced. Now we're gonna pop out our second dim. Ta-da! So in only a few minutes time and not using any tools, I was easily able to upgrade the memory in my custom built PC, literally double the memory and pay the exact same price that I paid for it a few years ago. So. Ultimately, if you're going to build a computer, 
It's great because you can keep on top of the upgrades and as you wanna add more, if I wanna add a new graphics card, I can do that. So if you learned something from this video, make sure you head down below, hit that like button. It actually makes a difference. And if you wanna see more videos like this one, smash that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy out there.